what are the different conventions for using SI units that we are going to see. Okay, so first convention is representation. We have to represent any SI unit by its symbol like unit Newton which is the SI unit of force, meter is the symbol of meter which is a unit of length like this we have to represent the units. Second convention is full name should start with small letter even if it is name of any scientist like uh, for an example we take Newton Newton should be the name of unit not Newton okay or one more example I can give you Kelvin should be the name of unit not Kelvin I hope guys second convention is also clear to you third convention is no plural form no plural form it means what we can't say that uh, I have I have 10 meters of 10 meters of string 10 meters we can't say 10 meters we have to say 10 meter so that is the correct uh, convention now the fourth convention is no full stop what does it mean by no full stop after any unit we should not give any full stop it means what after uh, the symbol if we are giving full stop that doesn't come under convection we should avoid uh, this practice to put full stop after the any symbol of unit suppose one sentence is ending with one symbol at that time you can give full stop but af immediately after symbol in between uh, symbol is coming then you can't give any full stop that is what the fourth convection uh, now let's see fifth convention fifth convention is about ratio okay if there is ratio of two units let's take example of acceleration for acceleration what is the what is the unit acceleration is velocity upon time and unit of velocity is meter per second and unit of time is second so here second comes two times so meter per second divided by second this should not be the unit what should be the unit meter per second square or meter hyphen second raised to minus two that should be the method of writing not this okay sixth combination okay if there are two units in combination newton per meter square suppose for an example which is unit of pressure okay here there should not be newton per meter square or there should not be like newton per square meter okay these are the wrong methods of uh, showing units this is the correct convention to show the uh, unit in combination let's go for seventh one seventh one is prefix prefix so what does it mean by prefix we have to keep uh, we have to put one letter before unit it means what uh, let's take example of second before second if i put m then it means millisecond millisecond and which is equal to and one millisecond is equal to 10 raised to minus 3 second let's take another example if i put micrometer then what does it mean micrometer which is equal to 10 raised to minus 6 meter so so this prefix changes the uh, meaning of the unit now go for last one that is we have to put space or hyphen between two symbols okay let's take an example newton meter we should not write it like newton meter we have to write it like newton space meter or newton hyphen meter or one more example i can take velocity meter per second i should write it like meter hyphen second raised to minus one or i can write meter 
second raise to minus one i should not write it like meter second raise to minus one it will look like milliseconds okay so we should avoid such a practice all right i hope guys conventions for writing uh, units are also clear to you i hope you found it useful uh, still if you have any doubts you can ask me in comment section below i will try to answer those and if you found this lecture series useful please don't forget to subscribe our channel i will see you in the next lecture